Come on, why ain't you chasing me? Scared? All right. Since you're not coming to me, I'm coming to you. Holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap. Nanny, he moves. Now he moves. Hello, everyone. Boyne Sarge here. Welcome back to some more Dawn of War 2, playing through the entire campaign. And the last episode, we finally made it to Meridian, and the, the local government is more or less not very cooperative with the Space Marines. They're making us run around doing all these errands just so we can access Angel Forge. And even then, they might not let us use it. But we'll see what happens. So we secured this area. We took on, I believe it was a large, yeah, it was. It was a large number of Eldars, including a, a fire prison tank. So that was a, a, a nightmare. If you missed that episode, there'll be a link in the little a link right up here. It'll pop up. You guys can go click that link. Go check out the episode. It's a pretty good one. And, uh, yeah. Oh, crap. Looks like we're going to be um, taking on the Wraith Lord. So let's get started. Commander, we have detected a major Eldar incursion. A large alien force has struck a series of Imperial Guard positions and civilian transport hubs in rapid succession. A powerful Wraith Lord Walker reportedly led the attack. The alien host is retreating, but we have managed to keep sight of them. We need you to strike before the Wraith Lord escapes. Okay, so that Wraith Lord is going to take a lot to bring down. It's, it's, it's going to hurt. Okay, so let's check our gear, prepare for combat. And damage resistance, suppression resistance. Cover 12 health. Ooh, I like that. I'm going to give him that so he can get some more health back when he... Yeah. So he gets more health when he's attacking people. I like that. Uh, let's see. Why can't you use this yet? Level six, oh, you should have it. Hmm, I don't know why you can't use that. Um, but we're gonna keep him with the plasma gun, it's definitely gonna be needed here. Um, how much armor do you have? 16. Yeah, we're gonna keep you with that. You, however, uh, do we want to keep him with the rocket launcher? I mean, he does have these guys for support. Um, Rid of that we don't need that one. Um, I think I'm gonna keep him with the rocket launcher because we go up against the Wraith Lord, we're probably gonna need that, so we're gonna hold on to it. Um, yeah, we're gonna keep the snipe rifle with him, and ooh, I think I want to give him the shield. Oh, we don't have any on this planet, so that probably won't even help. All right, so he's gonna stick with that. And we're going to just try to keep the sucker at range. I would love to have this, give him this and just literally keep everything at range. I don't know. For now, I think we won't. We're going to have him keep doing his job. All right. Let's do it. Yep. And we get a reward. Ooh, a nice plasma gun. Ooh, I like that. All right, let's get it in there. <clears throat> See what kind of chaos and mayhem we get ourselves into. I love the city and the architecture. It looks really cool. That's why I love the Warhammer 40k University. It's just the architecture of every race. It looks pretty cool. Even the orcs. It 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 shouldn't make sense, but yet it just works. Okay, that was terrifying. <laughs> yeah, that's a Wraith Lord. Holy crap. Okay. Alright, so there's definitely been some fighting here. Uh, hopefully we get some guardsmen for support, but probably not going to happen. Um, and I haven't played this mission in so long, so I'm practically going in blind. So we'll see what happens. Okay. This giant wields bizarre and dangerous technologies. Our weapons will find their mark. 
I sure, I sure hope so. If if we don't, it's it's, it's probably gonna be a really short battle. Oh shit. Okay, let's uh, have you cloak. We'll have you go up there and snipe that target. Yeah, Eldar, it's not like the orcs are tyrannids. You actually have to use tactics against them. If you don't, you're gonna die. Snipe that thing. There you go. Get back, get back, get back. Stay there. Don't move. We at least need to pop this one in the back. So that way we don't get suppressed when we move up. Right, let's look where we're going to get that chance. Uh, tactical. Tactical, tactical, move up. Getting the good news. There you go. There you go. Right, let him up. Let him up. There you go. Oh, yeah. All right. So that's there. How are we going to get up there? This way. Okay, so we're going to make our way up here and then back, grab this, get the supplies, and then push up, grab this one, and then we will make our way towards the right floor. <laughs> um, do I want to grab that or the communications array? I think the communications array will be a little more beneficial, hopefully. Uh, let's go. Move out, everybody. And just watch out for... Oh, yeah. There they are. There you go. Watch out for the warp spiders. I hate those guys. Back up. Whoa! Holy crap. You got the sniper. You guys. Throw a grenade right in the middle of them. There we go. Oh, yeah. We got this. Now you fall, Eldar. Oh shit. Oh crap. Our foes grow in strength. Get him, get him, get him. Knock him back. Crap, 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 crap. I don't want him to die right now. Take that one out. Right, we got this. There we go. Uh, Cyrus. Wow, you have to run all the way back there. Actually, it really sucks. Okay, I need you guys. How close are we? Probably not close enough that I really want a chance bringing them out without a full squad. So I'll make them run back quickly. I didn't realize, but they actually lose experience for running. Okay, no more running unless it's absolutely an emergency. Okay. I didn't know that. That's weird. After all these years, you figure I would have known that about this game. 
One more. One more. There we go. Now get your butts up here. Have just can you can you please not shoot your cover? Never mind. We're almost here. Down. There you go. A song? Nah. Alright, we're gonna push up this way. Oh, hang on. I let me now, Eldar. Did that hurt? Okay, apparently it didn't even hurt him. Get into tactical, get into a tactical position, guys. Oh crap, don't go that way. Is that literally on every side? Snipe that thing. There you go. away all right that was intense oh okay um hi no we don't want to deal with him right now guys serious oh that's not the right floor we're looking for but it's sure the one that's gonna hurt the most fall back fall back fall back seriously dude fall back Cyrus. How can we reposition? Pop a grenade in there. Weapons ready. You on my way. Moving to your attack. Tactical range and rest not, brothers. There are still targets to engage. Woo. Please tell me there's no more Eldar. I'm glad I brought that rocket launcher. Why are you not healing? Seriously, why is he not healing? I don't like that. Let's fly. Pop it with a grenade. I love having grenades that are pretty much infinite. Really nice. So now we gotta push forward. Okay, 
We got him suppressed. We got him pinned down. Good. Cyrus, what do you see? They were better than you know their cunning, but I have them in my sights now. One step Rap. Well, that didn't work. I want to know why my commander is really not wanting to heal. Because that's very inconvenient. Pop him with a grenade. There you go. Pull back, get some health on ya. Alright, push up. Eldar in every direction. So yeah, we're gonna go get the communications array. Force Commander, you mind? Thank you. Gain the better vantage. Okay, so we do have some bad guys. Oh crap. Okay, so they have quite a few guys. Knock him out of every building. No mercy for the misguided. Get up here, don't let that thing hit us again. Loose formation. I had something a little bit more of a punch. Adjust your position. Acknowledged. That's a good position. There now. Okay. While well, he's aiming. Going for ah oh, crap. Snipe it, kill it. back this is getting hard <laughs> I mean really hard All right, pick him up and then run we got to resupply okay let everybody regroup and get ready
So he he's looking a little bit more healthier. <laughs> hmm. All right, let's go. So, okay. Readiness is all. Please be vigilant. When judgments are coming out of stealth, hostile movement up ahead, brothers. Can you snipe him from there? Oh no, we're getting from here with the missile launcher, apparently. I mean, you're gonna see me argue with that. How you like it when we have the high ground advantage, boyos? Ooh, that was a good one. Okay, Cyrus. Got that building. Bye. Make ready, brothers. Repositioning. Adjust your position. That is a lot of banshees. I won't lie. Huh. On the offensive. Field generators are deploying now, Commander. Additional generators will not be available until your next deployment. Okay, that's healing them though. Okay. At your command. Come over here. You guys also get over here. We're gonna take these banshees down real quick too. As you order. Actually no save that shot. There you go, Cyrus. Take that thing out. Alright, we're doing okay. We're fine. She took a rocket launcher to the face and still alive. What's something wrong with that picture? <laughs> All right, uh, so we're making a good time. Uh, once now that we have this, we can heal ourselves once we're up here fighting this thing, which is good. Don't let them get close. Another enemy crushed. Okay, we're practically good to go. Let's do this. Time to finally go kill a Wraith Lord. Which, I, if I remember the, the Eldar Lord, someone could correct me in the comment section down below, is technically like a demigod? Holy crap.
Kill this thing quickly. There we go. Now it's time to take out a Wraith Lord. Okay. You there. Okay, Rick Lord, bring it on, dude. Oh, God, I remember this thing is a pain. Absolute pain. At your command. Come on, Rick Lord. Give it the good this news, guys. Brothers, we go. Bye. Readiness is all. Oh, here they come. All right. Um. Kill out those warlock guys. Oh, these guys are terrifying. Yeah, they're psychers. Ah, what's it? That's the word. Yeah, look at the size of it. No time for gaping. Time for shooting. Cyrus, move back. All right, light it up, boys. Light it up, light it up, light it up. Come on. You don't want to come fight us? Bring it on, you little... Ooh. Oh, no, he's coming. He's coming now, guys. Press the target. You, I need you to go back and heal. You, snipe shot. Oh, crap. Alright, we got him. Suppress. Oh, I hate warp spiders. I really do. You guys go back, heal up quickly, come back. We'll keep this thing somewhat occupied. Right. You know when you guys are fully ready to go? Not even close yet. Get up here quickly. Are we winning this thing? Yeah, we're cheesing it. The chapter's recruits stand ready. Be vigilant. Get in tactical to, uh, get somewhere where you can aim and shoot. Got it. Can't get the words out of my mouth. Come on. Oh, 
I don't like that attack. Holy crap, he moves. I mean, he really freaking moves. Come on. Come on. Bring it on. Oh crap. Oh crap. Come on, why ain't you chasing me? Scared? All right. Since you're not coming to me, I'm coming to you. Holy crap, holy crap, holy crap, holy crap. Nanny, he moves. Now he moves. I don't have any stimulants left. Okay. Stay there. You guys. There. There's there. It, keep the Eldar suppressed. We almost got this thing. Now he's coming in. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Oh, no, no, no! My commander has been avenged! <laughs> the warlock mentioned another Eldar, Idranel. This could be the Eldar leading operations in the sector. I will contact the fleet commander. Chapter records may hold information on her. I believe they do. I can't remember. Oh, wow. That was uh, interesting. So, yeah, we cheesed that pretty hard. <laughs> uh, do I care now? Not really. But everybody leveled up, which is nice. Awesome. Now what? an analysis of additional data recovered from our recent battles against the Eldar on Meridian. They somehow managed to interfere with our scans of the Meridian system. That's not I good. compensated, and I fear there is far more evidence of Tyranid infestation on Meridian than I believe. What's more, long-range scans show the High Fleet is accelerating toward the capital world. Not good. They have transferred protocols for counteracting the Eldar sensor baffling to key stations across Meridian. Commander, this is Elena de Rosa. The skies, I mean, this alien swarm is filling the skies over Meridian. Yeah. Now she wakes to the threat. I, I apologize for my rudeness earlier, Sergeant Avatus, was it? The Eldar sabotage campaign has crippled our defenses. Your help in keeping Meridian secure is critical. Where is Governor Vandis in all this? Governor Vandis and the Privy Council have withdrawn to strategize. My In other words, they ran. Meteor warnings has already cost hundreds of thousands of lives in the Hab Spires. Commander, I implore you, help us keep Meridian from falling. Holy crap! Everything's holy crap. So it looks like we're fighting Tyranids next. Oh, lovely. Good thing we got flamethrowers now. <laughs> Because <laughs> we're going to use them. So let's see what we can level up here. Um, so we can grab that or focus on that. Um, after Victory Force Commander becomes uh, invulnerable for a short time. That could be useful. And killing an opponent when hand hand in combat. So this will also just... Wow. I want that, but I also want that. Huh. I think I'm going to go towards this. So once we get this, oh, he's going to be just an unstoppable killing machine. And it's going to be awesome. All right. So he's leveled up. All right. For you. And that is on hit reduce the target's uh, armor for a duration. 
Okay. That's nice. I think all plasma does that. Uh, I'm not going to mess with his weapon right now. I'm going to keep what he has. If anything, he's going to be going between this and a flamethrower. This for orcs and Eldar. This beautiful monstrosity for Tyranids. So we're going to get rid of that one. So I'm going to keep this plasma. Even though it's a little weaker, uh, it does a little bit more damage over time. So we're going to keep that. It is coming. It cannot be harmed for several seconds. Yes, we're going for that. Yeah, so you can fire plasma guns and flamethrowers on the move. Yes, please. We got that. Because that would be nice. You can just run and shoot things with flamethrowers. Um, since we're going against Tyranids next, we're bringing out the heavy machine guns. Um, now he has unlocked the Terminator trait. So now, we can once we get some Terminator armor, we can give it to him. Uh, okay, let's grab that. All right. He's good to go. And you, Cyrus, what do we want to give you? Cyrus, mm, I don't know if I want that one. Basically, equip. Ooh, flamethrower would be nice. Like I said, once we go against Tyranids, flamethrowers are amazing. So with that, he's really good at going out and reviving people. That's what I've been using him for. And scouting. Um, I want to work towards this. Once we're done with that, then we're going to work down this line. Okay. I think that will do it. And when we go against the Tyranids, I'm probably going to drop the sniper rifle. And give him a bolt gun. Because he can lay down a little more firepower quickly. Because sniper rifles, no, nah, actually, no, I'm going to keep it in case we run into those big, like, hive mind ones and he can snipe them and then do some serious damage. All right, so that's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. So, as you guys can see, there's a severe Tyranid infestation going on on Meridian. So, the next few episodes are going to be pretty interesting, to say the least. So, but again, that is going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode as much as I did playing it. And if you guys have any comments, suggestions, or feedback about this episode or this Let's Play series, let me know in the comment section down below. Also, if you guys want to keep up with the channel and uh, keep up to date what is going on, hit the bell notification icon as well as subscribe to the channel. You can follow me over on Twitter as well as my Discord to keep everybody up to date what is going on over on those two areas. So... Hopefully see you guys over there. Uh, links for all those will be in the description down below. Also, if you guys want to hang out with me, talk with me, and have and hang out with other YouTubers and other gamers and have loads of fun having gaming days, you can head on over to my Discord. In, again, links for that will be in the description down below. Also, I'd like to take a moment to say thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much for supporting the channel going the extra mile. It really means a lot to me. Every dollar does help me bring more awesome content like this to you guys on the channel. So if you guys want to help support the channel, every dollar does help. A uh, link to my Patreon will be in the description down below as well at the end of the video. Till next time, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys. Remember, have an awesome day.